Hey, what's up guys? Too Tall Toby here, and today we're gonna take a look at a very special model because this model actually got turned into a physical part made out of aluminum. And this is all thanks to our friends over at Zometry.com. So if you're not familiar with Zometry.com, you can visit them at Zometry.com. And this is where you can get custom manufacturing done on demand. That means if you've got any 3D model, you can just drag and drop it right here onto the homepage and you can get an instant quote to find out what it would take to get that part made out of a physical material like aluminum. And on your very first order, you could save 40% using coupon code TOBY40. Now this is a limited time offer. This offer, this coupon code will expire December 31st, 2025. And we've got some additional details about this promo down below in the description. Be sure to read those details. But if you're looking to get your first parts manufactured by the team over at Zometry, this could be a great opportunity to save some money using coupon code TOBY40. The cool thing is this works with any 3D CAD system. So whether you model this part in SolidWorks or FreeCAD or Inventor or Fusion or Onshape, you can use this instant quoting system. But if you are using Onshape, you can actually get to something else that's pretty cool, the Zometry app for Onshape. This is a totally free app. You just subscribe to the app and then it will show up here in Onshape. And what makes this so cool is it actually does some design for manufacturing checks before you submit your order and get your quote. And what I mean by that is when you're looking at a part like this, there may be certain features that are gonna be a little problematic to see and see. One of those features, at least in my opinion, is gonna be this edge here being sharp. When I see this edge here being sharp, I think to myself, that's gonna be really difficult to machine and to maintain a sharp edge, especially in this region right here. And so what would make this a lot easier and probably a lot cheaper would be if we added in a nice radius here for like a ball end mill or for a radius end mill to get up and around those corners. Well, this is something that the Zometry app for Onshape will identify and will let you know that that's a problem. It even gives you some guidance on how you can resolve it. So first thing you do is you go to the app store, you search for Zometry, and then you subscribe to this app. And then what you'll see is the app shows up over here right in the Onshape interface. So we just click on the app and you can see here the app says, let's add a part to get it instant quoted. We're gonna add this universal bracket and next. And then once we add this part here, we can see that this part is going to use the process of CNC machining. The material is going to be 6061 and the finish is going to be standard. We're going to click get estimate. And now what happens is we're not only getting the instant quote, but we're also running through a series of design for manufacturing checks. And so hopefully on shape and Zometry are going to identify that sharp edge as being a problem. So here we see the instant quote comes up. It's going to be $656 and we we see, oh, the design for manufacturing check only passed nine out of the 10 available checks. So let's click on that button there and we can see the list and, oh, it's the internal corners that are failing here. The internal corners in this design for manufacturing checklist here. So, okay, can we get any more guidance on this thing? Well, what we can do is we can click here on this preview and it actually shows us the corners that are the problem. So there we go. As suspected, it's gonna be those corners, but really what we should probably do is just add a fill in here along this entire thing. Now, in order to determine whether or not we can add in that fillet, we really need to understand what this part is being used for. And what this part is being used for, it's called a universal bracket. I wanna mount this thing outside on my woodshed. It's gonna be outside all year. That's why I don't wanna 3D print it because it'll just get weathered and it'll kind of deteriorate. But if I can make it out of like a nice aluminum, yeah, then we would be in business. And so what this thing is designed to do is it's designed to hold a solar powered light that I've got. And that solar powered light can either mount this way. So here's the shroud for the light. It can either mount this way or it could mount down below here. So it could also mount kind of down below here. And so what this part has is it's got a, a receptacle for both sides. It's got this receptacle on the bottom, receptacle on the top, and then it's got a little hole here for a locking pin. So with that being the case, it really doesn't matter if I go through here and I add in a fillet. I should be able to add in a fillet here, no problem. It's not gonna affect the way that this part works. The cool thing is because this app works right inside of Onshape, I don't have to like restart or resubmit the quote or anything like that. I can just go into Onshape here and add in that fillet. So maybe I'll make this fillet a little bit bigger, like an eighth inch or three sixteenths, or maybe even a quarter inch here for that fillet. 
That looks like that should be okay. Maybe I'll go to like 3 16th, you know, make that. Yeah, there we go. Just make sure I stay out of the way of those holes so that the uh, the bolt head doesn't get in the way. But I think that should work out pretty nicely. So I'm going to hit the green check mark here. Currently, the quote is for $656 and one of the design for manufacturing checks failed. I'm going to click back here. I'm going to click get estimate. And now this time we see that the estimate comes in a little bit cheaper, $614, and none of the manufacturing che checks failed. And so now we can see that we are able to order this thing. We can indicate what our quantity is, and we can say view zometry instant quote. Now, what this will do is it'll let us finish our quote by selecting some additional options, like is this part ITAR com compliant or does this part need to be ITAR compliant? Nope, it doesn't. And then we can also see here that we can choose if we want to get it manufactured outside of the United States or inside the United States and we can indicate how quickly we need this part to be delivered to our shop and so that is the instant quoting system once we're done with that we can say continue to check out and that is where we can input that coupon code Toby 40 to save 40 percent on our first order so I really like this system. I like the fact that it works with any 3D CAD system. You can upload your files from any 3D CAD system. But I also really like the way the app works directly inside of Onshape to kind of help me make better decisions about the manufacturability of our parts. But now the ultimate question, did this thing work? And so if we flip over here to full screen, let's take a look at this part. This part is absolutely beautiful. I love the surface finish on this thing. It's just so smooth, just kind of so happy with this thing, with how this thing looks, with how it feels. And what about the fit? Does this thing fit correctly? Well, the answer is, of course, of course it fits correctly. So here we can see the solar powered light. So this thing has a little pigtail here that, that goes off to the solar panel. And then here's the light itself. And then here you can see on the side, the, the locking pin. That's the hole there for the, it's, it's a little bit uh, beefed up there from the locking pin that I was testing it with, but that's the hole there for the locking pin. And so the idea here is that this can either feed in from this top hole here or from the bottom hole. Let's feed this thing in from the bottom hole. And so that pigtail should fit through that hole perfectly. Oh yeah, like a glove, that's what we like. And then this receptacle here should just fit right around that light and it should line right up with that locking pin and look at that, that is what we want. And so that is going to sit out there on the woodshed and that way I can mount it at whatever angle I want. I can flip it from one side to the other to get a little bit more flexibility on this thing. And of course, because I've got these locking pins in here, I could maybe uh, create some other type of a coupling to mount other things like a Bluetooth speaker or maybe some other things. So I really like this design. I'm really happy with how this came out, but I gotta say, I'm just super happy to have this thing made out of aluminum. I like the way these uh, these fillets worked out as well in here. That, that just came out so smooth. I'm sure that made it a little bit easier on the manufacturing team. So if you are ever in need to get your physical parts made out of metal or any other high grade material, be sure to check out Zometry.com. Use coupon code TOBY40 to save some money on the way out on your first order. And of course, guys, be sure to hit the like button, be sure to subscribe, and let me know down below if you have any questions about this video.